Hey guys, this is Maggie. Um, so this is me trying to film this video again. I have filmed it once before, but I had too much private information that I forgot to cover up. So I'm going to shoot again. So this is a video of my A6 planner. Um, I've never tried, I've never tried this size. I think I was watching one, like a planner video of someone setting it, a a planner up and it was A6, sorry, I think I said A5, A6. Um, so I gave it a go and I love it. I feel like this is a size I'm going to stay in, like for real. Um, another reason why I wanted to film this video was because I challenged myself to find as many free inserts as I could and to put this planner together. So all of the inserts were free. All of the vellum were free or um, I made, and then some of the like deco whatever were things that I had in my stash. I wanted to do that because I had my pocket planner and I had spent so much money on that planner that I was like, look, it's not even half of, like halfway through the year, so you need to make this work. I do intend to buy a couple inserts, but not like, the, the, the setup has really saved me money. So just to show you, um, the planner is pretty thick, um, but it's just because I have stickers right here. Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. So when I open the planner up, I have my, this is a journaling card that I got from the planner spot. Um, just, just a, um, just a disclaimer. A lot of the things in here are from the planner spot because I love her shop. I have a little journal card that says you can start fresh every morning. I have my gold cards and then in case of emergency, I'm thinking about laminating these because they're getting kind of really. And here I have some stickers, just some random stickers from the Etsy and the planner spot. I have a lot of pictures from the planner spot in here. I'm not going to open that. And then in here, I have some stickers and some page flags. In the back of the planner, I have my insurance cards, a sticky note. It has three little, or sorry, two little slip pockets where I have stickers. And then another sticker trail pocket here in the back where I keep another journal card and some more stickers. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. So, um, this little clip I have bought it for my um, pocket planner and I just put it in here so um, the first page has a picture of my handsome son and this vellum that I printed out that says do all things with love and intention this period card from cloth and paper I put another um, journaling card I believe this one was from cloth and paper um, I made this vellum, well, I found the art and then I, it was free and I made this vellum and it says, by failing to prepare, by failing to prepare, you are preparing to fail. Then I got this, um, yearly calendar, but it has like the moon phases in it. Um, the next page I have a 2022 holiday and observances. Um, I got that from planning with B. This is that little sticky note that I had. Um, I found this inbox vellum and I printed it out. Uh, for anyone that hasn't printed vellum, I mean on vellum before, make sure you let it dry because I didn't let it dry and I ruined a couple. This is another 2022 um, year overview. I may, um, I had found some other ones and I may switch it out because this is this font is too small for me. So then I found um, a checklist for my inbox, and I was really happy to find this. Um, I put a little uh, Fox and Pip uh, two stickers together to put a little page marker. Then this is the um, the insert from the free monthly from Peanuts Planner Co.'s website. So at first I was having trouble. At first I was having trouble um, printing them out. But then I read the directions and it was easy. I think you have to print all the odd pages first and then put them in the, put them in to print the even pages. And it worked out fine. I love them so much that I don't think I'm going to buy 
calendar um, inserts next year. I'm just going to use no if she, uh, free ones if she puts one up. Um, to mark, my biggest problem with blank inserts were number one, they weren't dated. These are dated, so that's fine. And number two, they didn't have the um, holidays. But I have stickers from the planner spot that, that her holidays, and I just put them in there, and it works perfectly. So I have the whole year in here. And then um, on the back, I just have a sticky note with some um, dates for work. I have this little picture of my son. I put it from planner to planner. This is paper that came in an Erin Conjure notebook, the flora one. And I put it in here because I like the paper. It's like this linen type paper that I really like. Um, so I put a couple pages of those. This is like a bookmark that I got from um, a coil clipping from Erin Conjure. I put that in there. This little um, journey card was in my pocket planner and I just put it in here because I really liked it. Um, I think I have to skip that one page. Then I found a 2022 year overview and I was really happy to find this. Um, because I, put, I write important dates and then I track my menstrual cycle. Then I found this, this gold insert. Um, and it has like a hint of pink on there. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, like a, gold, a hint of pink here. Then I bought a contacts um, insert, and I was really happy to see that. You can fit like up to 12 in here. So, yeah, let me see. Two, four, six, yeah, in there. Um, I have this to do um, page flag, or not page flag, um, marker that I got from Point and Hun. Um, these are inserts from my pocket plan that have, private, that have information, they're the resource page ones. Um, I still need this information. I tried to make this pattern on here, but it didn't work out. As you can see, I had to white it out. So I, this is one of the inserts that I am planning to buy. Um, this is just 32-pound um, paper. Oh, yeah, I printed all of my inserts on 32-pound paper. I just, you know, was like, nah, let me just do it. This is a brain dump from Plan With B that I got for free. This is a notes page from Plan With B that I got for free that I just put some work information on there, work notes. Um, then I found this vellum. It says, choose what's good for your soul, not for your ego. Amen. Um, and then I put a cloth and paper ox octagon, like sticky, sticky um, note on there just to give it a pop of color. Um, this is a day on two pages with a checklist that I found for free. I am one of those people that likes to do um, checklists, so that was perfect for me. Um, and I put a few pages of that in here. Then I found this one. This is another daily, but this one says morning, afternoon, and evening, and you have a page for notes, and of course the checkbox. This is a, so this little page flag marker, I don't know what to call it, tab, um, I have bought from Etsy, and I trace a vellum to this shape so that I can have more. As you can see, I don't have any dividers. It wasn't that I wasn't able to find divider templates. It's just I don't like making dividers. Like I tried, I did it in my pocket planner, and they turned out okay, but it was too much of a hassle for me, so I plan to buy those. Um, then I have this weekly um, sticky note from Point and Hun. This is a task list manager that I found for free. So you, you write the description, you write the task, the description, what you need to do, and the dates. And it has two per page, and I really like it. Over here on the back of that tab, I have um, a Fox and Pip sticky note from like forever ago. I just like it. I never write on it. This is one of the um, tabs that I traced from the other one. This is paper from the cloth and paper. I mean, the planner spot. I accidentally punched the hole in the wrong side, but it doesn't bother me. Then this is a week on one page lined with um, a checklist here. Because, again, I'm all about my little checklist. This is a free printable, I believe, from Peanuts Planner Co. And I have like eight weeks in here. I haven't put anything down. Then I have another one of those coil clips from Cloth and Paper. All right, so this is kind of interesting. So um, I want I use I think everybody does too, 
but almost everyone uses the reoccurring tabs from Penis Planner Co. I have bought these yearly review on Etsy and I have bought a lot of them and I realized I hadn't used them. So I put um I put them on just the some paper from cloth and I mean from what is that shop? Penis Planner Co. Free Principle. And I plan to use this use this. So I have 2022 up to 2025. Then the next page is a daily habit tracker. It's a monthly one, actually. And um, I plan to use that. So I put it on just some, a Pen Peanuts Planner Co. insert um, so that I could write notes. Sorry. So that I could write notes on this side. On the top tab, I had written weight um, add to planner. But I actually found an insert for that. So I put some washi tape on it. And then on the back, is a mood tracker that I have bought from the same shop and I just put again I like the the, the black up the black up there and then I could just write notes on this side these are one of the um, tabs that I have bought from Etsy so I am a big quotes person I love um, when I find a new quote or read a new quote um, so I, I just kind of use some blank 32 pound paper cut to size and put it in there I forgot to mention that I did uh, put my bottom tabs again these I found on um, Aliexpress and I just put them there as a marker as well as some um, square page flags from cloth and paper this is a sticky note that I got from Scribble Prints Co a while ago so I have a few blank pages for quotes then comes a freebies tracker. Yeah, I actually found a freebies tracker. And guys, guess what? I didn't write down the websites, but um, I did s email myself all of these inserts so that I could use them time and time again. Next, I have a point and hun, like this is for a pocket. It's a half page. Um, I just wrote down all my Tombow colors that I use or that I have. Guys, you don't even want to know how much money I spent on Tomboy, on Tombos, like, because I bought them all separately, so, uh-uh. This is an insert from Peanuts Planner Co. that was in my pocket. That kind of gives you the idea of how much writing space you get with a, from a pocket to an A5, uh, A6. I'll keep saying A5, A6. Um, so this is, like, um, things I want to, things I need to do and renovations that I want to make. So I will be buying this insert because I love that insert. Then I found a Black Friday wish list. Um, and I um, plan to write that in. Then I found an add to planner checklist. I was really surprised to find this. I thought it was a cool idea. I don't think I would have put the, those two together. And in here, I write down everything that I want in my planner. And if I have it, if I found, have it or found it for free, I put an X. Um, if not, then, you know, I just look for it. Um, so yeah, that's that. Then I also found this, um, let's do this vellum. I printed this on vellum. I got my vellum from Amazon. It's like $11 for like a, like 200 sheets. Very cheap. And, but I like how flimsy it is for some reason. So I'm happy with it. So here I just have a notes page. Um, I'm using, this is the answer from Peanuts Planner Co. that I put that yearly review and stuff on there and the mood tracker and everything. Um, I love the check boxes or the line check boxes. So I plan to use this insert in multiple ways. I'm trying to use this insert for things that I need. Like if I need an insert for um, body me measurements or clothing sizes, I'm trying to like section it out on these. Because I feel like I don't need to buy an insert for every little thing. At least that's what I'm trying not to do. So yeah. Um, anyways, so this is a page flag, a marble journaly plastic card that I got from Scribble Prince Co. I wish I would have bought like five of those because I love it. In the back, I have a weight loss tracker. I'm not going to show you. Um, I just put weight loss and then I just write down how much I weigh I weigh myself every other day or whenever I remember so then in the back I just have more pages of that line paper next I found a appointments a free appointments insert 
Um, granted, these are all A5 sizes. I didn't size anything up or down. And then there's a page flag there. So this is uh, appointments for myself. Then I found uh, school information. Um, insert. Sorry. Um, and then I found this one that says, Ain't No Hood Like Motherhood. On the back of this one, I also put a fox in, um, sorry, cloth and paper, octagon um, sticky note. So the back of that school insert looks like this. Uh, it says child, teacher, phone, email, classroom, schedule, and site login. Over here is my son's appointments. His is marked in blue. This is the back of the Ain't No um, Hood Like Motherhood vellum. I really like that. Then I also um, have, this is another one of those tab pages that I bought. So this part um, is kind of like my work section. So I found this film that says become more aware of what it really, of what is really worth your energy. Amen. And I also put uh, one of those, uh, I got this one for AliExpress, a transparent sticky note just to give it a pop of color. I call this my pink planner because almost everything is pink or, you know, neutral. So, um, I found this important dates insert. This is from the planner spot. It's a free printable. And then on the back here, I have my emergency fun, um, challenge. Um, I just like that journal card. I think I got it from coffin paper. I'm not sure. Or the planner spot. So this is a free printable. I must stop. Everything was free. This is a free printable of a month with um, to-dos, like two rows of to-dos and check check boxes. So I use this because I have, I currently got a second job. Um, I couldn't just say no. It was so much money. Um, but I got a second job and I need to make sure that the days don't overlap. And plus for the second job, I have to make sure that I write down um, the times that I entered and the times that I left. So that is what I'm using this for right now. Um, and I have the whole year in here. Um, this is a schedule, uh, the payroll, pay period um, of my main job. This is a little sticky note, I mean little insert that was in my pocket with information, um, teaching somebody at work and just wanted to write down the things that we had done. So this is the important dates insert from Peanuts Planner Co. that was in the pocket. Not sure if I'm going to keep this because I'm not sure about it. Um, in addition, I have a in 2022 important date. So I guess it's like this. I didn't realize this is this. So I, I'm, I don't know. This was hard to print. I'll show you. So on this insert, I am tracking my, my paycheck. So this is what it looks like. Um, I, I track my paychecks on here because um, I want to make sure I have enough money for Uncle Sam when that time comes. This was extremely difficult to print because the crop lines were on the wrong side. So January was printing on the back instead of the front. So I had to make like my own crop lines. So, but yeah, that was a little hard. Um, then this is a Boss Babe um, tab that I made. I actually have a journaling card of this from cloth and paper which I just photocopied and printed on vellum and I really like it um this is my money section um I have not been able to find like a budgeting insert that I like so I'm gonna have to buy the monthly bills insert from penis planner co so this is the seven baby steps by dave ramsey here and then on the back it teaches you the types of uh incomes which was pretty interesting to me because i had no idea of some of these then this is a vellum that i bought for my pocket but it was too good that i didn't want to lose it i might photocopy it and print it on a bigger vellum i might do that but it says stressing about the future is not available at this time amen this is one of those pullouts from penis planner co um the 2020 overview not sure if i'm gonna use uh, buy that again this is a hustle goals plans um vellum that i bought from the planner spot 
and um, I just cut it to size and punched it in there. It was in my pocket. In the back, this is the yearly fold out from Peanuts Planarco's uh, website. It was free. And um, I just track my workouts. And then I have the, um, the grocery guide. I have a few pages of that. This was in my um, planner, my pocket planner. Just this top loading um, plastic thing and then I just put some stickers and some quotes this one's from cloth and paper um, here I have this little uh, hollow bow that I keep in there um, and then I also just use my my my, my great light gray mile liner sorry I don't know what's wrong with me today and my pilot friction in the four colors and as you can see I'm using those square page flags from cloth and paper as kind of like dividers so yeah oh in the back pocket I just have a, a receipt and my planet fitness um, schedule so yeah I just wanted to put this planner together because I wanted to show that you can you know set up a planner with just free printables and I am so grateful to the planner girls that planner guys and girls that do that because you know some right I, especially right now you know we're living on a budget cost of living is up but we love this hobby so much so i just want to say thank you to everyone that put up these freebies for for us and for me and you know for the planning community um because as much as it is to support and buy inserts it's also important to give back so thank you so much and i hope that you um like my video I will be buying inserts and I'll, um, you know, inserts for the things I need and I'll make a, a video of that too. Um, but for now, have a good one. Bye. Oh, I can't. Where's the button?